Hi, I'm Mark Manis, Director of Instruction at the Golf Center at the Highlands. Today I want to talk to you about one of my favorite drills. It's called an L to L drill. It's basically a short golf swing, but it does so many things. Most players want to come out here and hit the ball just as far as they possibly can, making great big swings, not really knowing where the club is, occasionally hitting one a long ways, but most of the time failing. I think your time would be better spent on the range if you spent some time figuring out where the club was, getting it into nice positions, and learning how to make it go through the golf ball that way. What L to L means is simple. When you swing the club back, about the time your left arm is parallel to the ground, I expect to see the club shaft make an L as you view it from here. Now in reality that club's leaning back a little bit, but we've made an L. What I'm looking for on the other side of the swing is that as we swing through, the club releases back up into another L over here. It's a backwards L, but it's an L. By doing that, I figure we've got the club hinged for speed and released for speed. It's the way we're going to create all the, golf, all the speed in the golf swing. So how does it look in motion? This is what we do. We set up get our normal address position, swing the club back parallel to the ground, parallel to the ground with our arms, and see what the shaft is doing when we get in those positions. What we're hoping to see is something like this. This is an 8-iron. I hit that pretty solid. I didn't hit it terribly hard. It's 90 yards to a red flag. I flew it well over the back of the red flag green. That's about 110 or 15, 20 yard shot. I'm not trying to hurt the ball. I'm just trying to feel the club work through these positions. If I do that, what I generally get is pretty good impact. So again, L to L. It's my favorite. For anybody that's really struggling with impact and wants more speed, this is a great drill. you'll learn where the speed comes from, how impact should feel. You get better control over the golf club. You get a chance to really know where square is in the golf swing because just making the practice swing back lets you figure out where the club face is. There's so many good things that happen from this. And if you're really struggling with it, it helps you understand, gee, I need a lot less tension because I'm frankly not trying to hit it very far. Relax, swing smooth, try the LDL drill. I promise you this drill will help you.